Hey guys, it's Green Ninja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for you to episode 17 and 17.5 of Jobless Reincarnation. So, as I said when I was watching both 15 and 16 about like what two weeks ago, um, and getting into this one, this one at first, um, I was a little hesitant if I needed to initially watch episode 17.5 with this episode. Um, because at first I, like, I heard there was an OVA for this. I think we were, I was, I was maybe at like episode 10 when I heard it was an OVA. And I was like, okay, I'll just leave it for the end of the episode, like of the series. That'll be the last episode. And then boom, we're done with the show onwards to season two, whenever that season two comes, right? And then I go and I watch 15, 16 and I see 17 and 17.5 and I was like that's the fucking OVA so I was like I'm guessing I'm now gonna have to go ahead and watch this now but it makes me kind of wonder what 17.5 um is going to entitle I'm guessing it's going to be whatever is gonna happen in this episode in Rudy's POV in 17.5 it might be Iris's POV which once again if it is that I'm not mad at it because I feel like Iris needs more, um, like, backstory. Like, not only backstory, but just character-wise. Like, there's, th there's times where I want to see what the heck she's doing when Rudy's doing whatever the fuck he's doing in that episode and such. Heck, I mean, it could be Roxy. We could get the reunion today, but something tells me we're not getting that reunion today. No, no, we're not getting it today. But other than that, it's got to get started with episode 17 and 3 two, one, go. <laughs> no, oh, we're gonna see this, oh. I didn't think it would have been this. Gone. Damn. Oh, my God. Oh. Yeah, but home's far away. All of it.
Jesus. Like, why are you doing this to me? God, remember when I just kind of, like, I liked Paul, but then also disliked Paul. Now I'm like, uh, I feel bad for Paul. Oh, so many emotions. Now, this had to be before he got caught, right? Right? I, I mean, yeah, Rudy OP, like, out of all the OP OPs. <laughs> that too. I mean, exactly what he means. <laughs> I'm hungry. Usually kids are like that. a lot of stuff that he has to worry about. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, because it's more or less to impress you. That too. He can't tell you, like, all the bad things that happened. I was about to say, mm. And you can still find the rest of your family. Secretly, probably us.
Okay, computer? No, not really computer. USB. Come on. I'm like only nine minutes into it. Give me 13 more minutes and then we'll fix the damn problem. good. It makes me hungry. Mm. Wait, I... Wait. <laughs> Let them talk. So, anything, someone speak. Rudy. Yeah. Well, yeah, cause her grandpa, grandpa go. <laughs> But still, she might need to see it with her own two eyes. He's your father after all. Mm-hmm. 
Unless that look of disappointment. Mm-hmm. And that was the one only other friend that you had. He never came. Yeah, that's his pride. He let go his ego and came to apologize to you. Oh, Lumic, what the fuck? <laughs> this child. Oh, are you gonna hug? They're gonna hug. Yeah. yeah, at least embrace him a little bit more. God damn it. Oh my god. <laughs> now if we don't see him reunite you know, with Sylvia, I'm gonna sue. They made up. <laughs> yes, babe, we know, we know, we know, but that's his dad still. black guy it's okay you have another one
Oh no! Are they ever going to find her? Mm -hmm. Even if you would have made it all the way back home. And they'll reunite again. That's how we ended the episode, huh? Oh, okay, no. That just gives me hope. That's all. That's it. That's all. Big ass hope that yes. Dang, we didn't even get like an ending theme. Okay. Um, but that really truly gives me hope that eventually Rudy will find the rest of his family. Like I, I don't know when because we are very close to the end of this show. Um, but just to see, you know, both of them put their differences aside, especially with what happened in 15 and 16 after the fight. And Rudy was like, you know what, let's just pretend this didn't happen, that we're going to start off on a brand new foot and we're going to hug this out. Because I haven't seen you in forever and you haven't seen me for in forever and you thought I was dead. So let's just take this time to be in this moment as of right now because in this moment we're both okay yes not all of us are here as of right now because the rest of his family could be anywhere um and such it's the same thing with it is his family even though you gran grandpa 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 gone grandpa is dead d-e-a-d dead gone goodbye he will never come up again but even like still i wish we kind of would have i cannot speak um, of the mission of getting at his home and then they all arriving home and then that's when like the very emotional depression you know serious moment of okay everything's gone um the look of despair would have been on their faces being like what the fuck do we do now like everything truly is gone 
Um, but I do love the fact that he also told her in this episode, even though I was a little skeptical and I'm like, should you really tell her this now? Because even though in her mind, I think she also thought to herself, like, yeah, everything's possibly gone. I may never see my family, my friends, whoever, you know, extended family again, but all I have is you. It's just you three and then anyone else we run to and we have a relationship with them for a little while and then, you know, we continue on our journey. But like I said, here's hoping that we do end up finding his family before the series ends because like I said, we are very close and I want the show to end on a happy foot before we go into season two and whatever the fuck season two has in store because y'all know. You know, you could just tell me what the fuck happens in, se in season two, and then I don't have to watch it. But at the same time, I need to know. Like now. Not not tomorrow. Not, you know, a couple of months from now. Not even on my birthday next month. I want to know right the fuck now. So yeah, you could just tell me everything if you really want to. But go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for episode 17.5. All right, episode 17.5 in three, two, one, go. What well, damn? So, of course, yeah, he was saved, got a brand new life. Mm hmm. All the riches. But I bet you he wasn't happy. N now he's happy. Now we're going to find out in this episode why the heck it is got a black eye. <laughs> oh, that looks good. I mean, hey, just pay the toll or get out. That's all. Hmm. 
This how she gonna get her ass beat. <laughs> I can't. Uh. Hmm? But you're just a kid, babe. You don't want to get hurt. Seriously, don't bark on the wrong tree. Oh, here, here she come. You okay? Hmm? Oh, you see that twitch? Who? Oh, it is. Don't do it. Okay, you know what, you little shit. Oh. <laughs> he got his ass beat. He's like, you know what? I'd rather be a simp right now. It's cute. Look at him. Look at him. Oh. <laughs> Cliff has to be the little boy who is in that little thing at the beginning of this episode. <laughs> yeah sorry so you know mm, you can't do what that 11 year old boy does you want to try But damn, that's not bad though. Ooh. 
Oh, God. Yeah, she gone. She was like, enough of this. Mm -mm." (laughs) It is still kicking this boy's ass. Oh, my God. That's the reason why. The fact that you have to say that so quickly and and Rudy can just do it with the snap of his fingers, you're not ready. This kid! Oh my god. So let's just go home. Fine if you want to get your ass beat. <laughs> it's a pretty scenery. You can already tell something bad gonna happen in this. Come on now. <laughs> we are eleven minutes in. <laughs> Boy, I swear to oh, ah. yeah, what do we do? Huh. Okay, her cousin kind of, you know, love her in a way. Yeah. Yeah, I was getting scared now. And if there's not... Hey, um, that's a crow, right? That's not a good sign. Oh, he sure is. A little pervy, but, you know, very good. Very important person. Oh, damn. Wait, it is. Oh. 
then you stay here, you sit your behind down, and you just watch. Huh? Oh, she pretty. Oh, damn. Damn. Yeah, how do you get out of here? What about Cliff? Come on, let's go. Oh, you about to get killed. Something tells me Cliff is about to be, you know, a little bit more engaging in the rest of this story in a different way. I don't know how, but he seems like he's going to be an important character. That's why he had his face covered, because that little girl would have possibly noticed him. Yeah, in a way, she is in love with Ruby. Smart. Amazing, yes. Once again, a little pervy, but amazing. Oh, but he can.
Well, he getting jealous. Cliff, don't be stupid. Aww. Of course, it would show <laughs> Rudy and her walking because he just knows. Damn, poor baby. Yeah, you about to get the shit beat out of you. Oh, we know. That's it? That's it? That's it. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, but still, something does tell me he's gonna have a bigger thing in here. We Okay, look, so I think it's, what, 24 episodes? So 18, 19, 18, 19, 21, 22, 23, 24. I got six more episodes left before I'm done with this. Cliff, he if he's not going to be big as I think he's going to be, for the rest of these last episodes that we have with this show, then he's probably going to be an even bigger antagonist for season two when that comes up. So that does make me want to go back and look at the season two trailer to see if he's in it. Um, I, I, I'm a little confused. So this, the fact that this happened on the same day he saw his dad and got into a fight with his dad. I was expecting this to be like at the same time as episode 17, but it was episode 16. Like, oh, oh, but something tells me, yes, we are seeing Cliff again. In some way, shape, or form. Don't know how. Don't know when. But we're seeing him again. And it's not going to be good when we see him again. I feel like he's going to immediately try to kill Rudy. Now that, like, you know, Ed has killed his teachers, like, right in front of him. Bruh, how the fuck is this show going to end? But it was really good to tie in, um tie this in to episode 16 because at the same time I think when I did watch it I was like well yeah what the heck did Edis do you know while Rudy was doing his stuff and I do like that because like I said Edis is like she she's my favorite character of this show besides Sylvie even though Sylvie ain't here and, and the same thing with Roxy but we haven't seen Roxy in a little minute but hopefully Roxy shows up again before we're done with this show um 
but just to see like or have an episode truly focus on her i'm very grateful for it and i hope that when we do eventually get into season two or really however you know season one ends and going into season two that you know she gets more development in it so that is like my little just you know hope and prayers and stuff hopefully you know if cliff does come back again it he's not like as upset oh but something tells me i think he will be i was expecting him to like follow edis until he saw rudy but no I, th the funny thing was that this boy was like hold up edis please marry me but like boy like see you now you really simping like i understand yes edis like badass queen yes because i get it but boy, like you've only known her for less than a day. Less than the day. And you think she's the one? You think she a Marion type? Sir? My son? Boy? Hold the F up. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Uh-uh-uh. Because see, this is like the same thing with me and such. And then, you know, when a guy like literally wants to like DMs you and he wants to be in a relationship with you. And I'm like, boy, I don't know you like that. I've only known you for like less than a couple of hours. And you live all the way in Peru. How is this going to work for me? Uh-uh. I I'm just saying. Yeah, I had to put my little two cents into something that happened to me recently. But yeah! Other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode 17 and 17.5 of Jobless Reincarnation. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for Patreons and next Wednesday for everybody else for episodes 18 and 19. <laughs> but until then i will see you guys all next time bye